We were looking at the cover of your book, Preferential Policies, an International Perspective, published by Morrow. Thomas Sowell is our guest, and we have about 20 minutes left in our discussion. In history, who are your favorite, uh, not politicians necessarily, but who are your favorite people in history? Oh, my. Do, do you mean uh, historic figures, or do you mean people whom, whom I sort of looked up to when I was growing up? Who do you follow? I mean, over the years, who have you followed? You know, the Winston Churchill types in the world. Oh, I think Winston Churchill was the greatest man of the 20th century. Um, and I find it horrifying that most American high school students do not know who Winston Churchill what is. What's so great about him? One thing alone, I think, would, I, I think that he probably, if any one man could be said to have saved Western democracy, that one man would be Winston Churchill. But he saw the enormous dangers that led to World War II, warned against them, that if he had been heated in time, there might have been 40 million people who wouldn't have lost their lives. But even being heated at the 11th hour, it was enough for him to pull Britain through. Had Britain not pulled through, it's very doubtful that the United States would, be, would have pulled through. And in that case, it's highly unlikely that I would be sitting here alive. 